Uh, my first degree required job, air quotes, uh, was actually working at a nonprofit. And um, uh, this one will probably rile some feathers. Um, but a lot of people will say that nonprofits don't sell things. That's not true. Every every entity that is trying to make money in any way is selling something. Um, and sometimes even like anyone who's trying to get anything really, which is everybody is selling something. Um, maybe that's a pessimistic way to look at the world, but I did see that in not in the nonprofit world. So what nonprofits are selling is they're selling tax benefits and they are selling the benefits of whatever work and mission that they do and the feeling that someone gets from donating to them, to their donors. That's what they're selling. Um, and so what was interesting about that was it, I got, I was able to be as a fundraiser, as a development representative, you're able to be in a room with people who are, who are able to give to, to donate to the nonprofit that you're representing. And so what it enabled me to do was realize that like breakdown tactics. And I, the, the guy who was in charge of me, the, the development director gave me books that you and I have talked about on this podcast. They, they gave me, uh, he gave me the 22 immutable laws of marketing. Um, and then, uh, there's another sales book that I already forgot the name of. Um, but we'll try to remember it. I'm putting the show notes for everybody. Yeah, I'll try to remember. It. I think it might have been another Jack Jack Trout. I'll rise. I'll rise. Reese. Rise. Rise. Reese. Yeah, it was another one of those. But he gave me those two books. And it's funny too, because at the time I like kicked up I kicked up a big fuss about being given homework. <laughs> but I <laughs> like ended up reading those books much later, realizing that at the entire time I was doing sales. Whereas while I was there, I was insistent that I wasn't doing sales, but that's exactly what I was doing. Um, and so what you're doing is you're listening to their, you're listening to their wants, to their needs. Um, and then you are marketing, you're selling the mission and the benefits of the nonprofit to the person who you're about to ask for money, basically. Um, and it was interesting because it was just more, the asks that I was making were just like more money than I'd ever thought of in my life. You know what I mean? It was just like a, you know, just asking for the amount of money that I was asking for, like making that ask was sales. That's sales. That's a sales tactic. And if they say no, continuing to try to get past it is sales. That's a fundamental, that's just sales. That's all it is. 